today was a very magical day. I mean, we saw this incredible parade and we saw all this joy and happiness. And I bought these, these two lights at DuPont Circle for $5 a piece. And I sort of brought them here to sort of carry the magic of the day, the happiness of the day. I love lights. I used to deal in lighting. To come here and so I danced and I found some people want to dance with me. Then I realized that other people were dancing as couples. So I thought maybe I could bless their relationship. And I began blessing their relationship. And when I did that, I found, or even blessing their body, I found they were so responsive, they were so happy, they were so flattered that my lights were gracing their presence, glorifying their bodies all the way down. You know, the way I wish somebody would glorify my body, which is beyond glorification, probably closer to mummification. But anyway, that is how the gay blessing of the lights came to be. End of story from DuPont Circle in Washington, D.C. Randy Wicker telling you how it all began. Good night and good luck and God bless you. Randy, before we go, how alive did you feel giving that positive energy to gay, lesbian, bisexual, and transgender couples? It wasn't a question of being alive, it was a question of sharing the wonderful energy that I absorbed today, exhausting myself filming that parade. It was so fabulous and so wonderful. And in a way, these lights sort of captured it, even the little phony artificial lights, they sort of captured the magic, and I really felt that that magic somehow transcended the event and transformed itself and conveyed the magical power and the wonderful feeling that I had about the whole weekend to the couples that were dancing and loving one another.